So what is going on everybody? My name is Mehul and in this tutorial I'm gonna show you real quick how to make use of get and set in front of method members in not method members actually just methods in TypeScript and what they essentially do is that they actually define what you have to return or what you have to set it's kind of like object dot define property which we have in lower versions of JavaScript which is currently actually running as well this getters and basically accessors are you know a property of uh, a feature of ES5 and above so anyways let's just create a rectangle class and make some sites L1 number and L2 number right and then actually this should be a semicolon right and then constructor l1 number l2 is a number right and I say this dot l1 is l1 this dot l2 is l2 now what I can do instead is I can have an area here as a number and uh, I can say this dot area is uh, either l1 or l2 or this dot l1 times this dot l2 now this approach has a couple of problems the first one is that uh, um, if I create like my awesome rectangle is new rectangle and then pass it like 10 and 20 the first problem is that user can set the area I don't want that because the area would be automatically determined by the sides user pass in. The second problem is that uh, whenever I make changes to my sides, like if I say my awesome rectangle.n1 is something like that, and now if I console log area, it doesn't show me the correct one because area was set in constructor pro constructor method, right? So to fix this what we can do is actually we can create a method and set it to just getter so once we have like get area as a method and uh, I say return this dot l1 times this dot l2 now what happens is that uh, if I now do console dot log my awesome rectangle dot area the first thing this is not a method anymore because we are using a get property or you know using this method as a getter right the second thing is that since this is dynamic this returns this times l1 times this times this dot l2 it would work even if I change my sides or you know whatever inside code and then if I try to reflect it it would just work now if I build this you would see okay so you would see that accessors are only available when targeting ECMAScript 5 and you can just fix that by creating a TypeScript configuration file here and just setting your compile level or you know compilation to ES5 or something so this is not kind of an error for now this is just a warning so it just compiles perfectly and you can see that right here we are making use of object dot define property because that's how we define getters and setters like that and since it does not have any set function so doing something like my awesome dot area then doesn't have any effect right so it doesn't do anything if you set it to something so that is how you pretty much make use of getters in TypeScript and uh, that's all for this tutorial and the next one I'll just show you how to set how to make use of setters and uh, that's all for this one and if you liked it then don't forget to subscribe and thank you for watching